It's a Quebec camping ground, but before I get into this Ouija stuff, there's something we want to try here. It's called the Volant Volant, it's kind of like a like tree biking or something like that. We rented out this like 1950s RV trailer, which I will show you guys. But uh, right now we're taking a hike through the park, trying to find these cable cards. You nervous? No? Taking it like a champ? Oh yeah, <laughs> Hell yeah. That's good? Okay, okay. Yeah. so you have a red strap on your left oh and one God. between your legs. You have to pass it through. So this is like a 40-45 minute run through the trees. Oh. Alright. Oh. There she goes, guys. Ah, that's kind of cool. And All right, the perfect. pendle on your left should come back. That's the handle, perfect. Yep. So they're ready to go? Yep. Alright. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Alright, guys. Here we go. This is kind of actually really scary. So I'm not supposed to be on like the same wire. Like if you see this little thing right there, there's a bunch of them and I'm not supposed to be on the same wire or else we'll fall. So I gotta wait till Chelsea's over there. I think she might be close. Oh, look at this guys. This is crazy. This is actually awesome. On the way up here, it's kind of funny. This whole campground is like pretty much on the top of a massive hill. And when I say that, it's like the incline of that, like tore our car. Like I'm not even joking, like it tore. Like the wear and tear of the car was bad. But once you get up, it's really beautiful. Coolest thing too is that we stayed already a night. Like this is our second day and we're staying another night. It's kind of cool. So I'm already pretty far. So Chels took the honors to actually go first. She's ballsy, eh guys? She's super ballsy, that woman. Yeah, see guys, look. Look how steep that is. So we had to come up here, for real. Like this is where we almost got stuck. Cause like the campground is like up there. So we came like flying at like 80, coming up this goddamn hill. And went right over. There's a part of me that's kind of scared that I'm gonna fall. But I'm gonna take it because this is like, this is kind of fun. Holy crap. <laughs> hey, Charles. How you doing? <laughs> I don't know where she's going, but say hi to this guy. He didn't look. <laughs> So she's yelling at me, I don't know what's going on. Are you stuck? No, I do have to give it a good push to get through that metal part. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, okay, so apparently there's a metal part coming up. Gotta give it a good push. You go fast? Yeah, like I had to just like jump the puddles and push the brake. Okay, so there's Chels over there. Like I said, she's ballsy. It's where you gotta like kind of give it a good push. It's the metal part. I thought it was gonna fall there. You gain a lot of speed, eh? Oh, <laughs> take a look at this guy. So, got a nice belt. Even got like a whistle. You got a whistle here if you need it. Yeah. Overall, 
this place is pretty cool if you guys are in Quebec or Ontario um, come over here because this whole campground is pretty cool they have like tubing they have you know these cable cart tree bicycle things which we are on right now I'm stuck going so fast I think this is where Charles was taking some photos So we have to decently be spread apart here, like I said, but I'm sure she's fine, she's taking some photos. All I gotta say is though, if I fall, I'm screwed, like if anyone falls, we're screwed. Like look, pretty much fall to my death. Woo! Okay, I'm going fast now. <laughs> I'm going too fast. Woo! I'm coming for ya! <laughs> okay, I gotta slow down now. Oh, what? She's taking like a turn. She's going like the other way now. Whoa, okay, okay. Okay, now I'm like flying. Look. She's like over there now. I guess like you turn and stuff. Dang. Yo guys, just for your perspective, like look how, look how high she is right now. I don't know if you can see that, but like, she's like right there. But if I zoom out, like that's a pretty far gap. Holy shit. Dang, We're pretty high up. Oh, there's someone else over there. This is nerve wracking, yo. You won't catch me doing this a year ago. Kind of built up the courage to kind of take over my fear of heights. I don't know where they are. There's somewhere behind me, but there's other people coming along here. Like, Ooh. I'm always scared like the worst is gonna happen, but you gotta live your life guys like this is actually cool But the one thing that I do not recommend is that if you're scared of heights, this is not the ride for you Damn, I'm high. I'm actually really freaking high up guys Chelsea's taking it like a champ. She's all the way up there God damn <laughs> We out here living! Yeah! This is actually awesome, guys. You got all the cars. Damn. This is wicked. This is actually insane, yo. This is actually insane. So on the way up, I actually didn't know, but we were coming up this really steep hill here. And... I guess people were using these like right above us. Didn't even see them. They're pretty high up though. She's enjoying this. She also loves this stuff. I don't know where anyone else is, but there's people coming up behind us. Not gonna lie though, we're pretty high up. So like if anything else goes wrong, like I'm not joking guys, like we are screwed. But you gotta take risks sometimes guys, like this is actually awesome. It's not every day you get to do something like this. Is she okay? She's just going. <laughs> God damn, that girl just keeps going. That's awesome. Okay, that scared me. This is getting me a little bit terrified now. We're going even higher. I think we're pretty high up now. I think this is the highest point you can actually be right now. Okay, I hear people coming behind me. I'm gonna step on my game. It's getting nerve wracking because the guy said, if you get too close to each other, the wire kind of sinks and like it could like drop. 
This is actually the highest point, guys. It's crazy. I don't know where that girl went, man. She's just flying through all this. So down there is actually a pod. It's a nice little thing that you have to rent to stay here. Wow, this is making you push through. But yeah, you can rent those things here. That wasn't a good sound. Yeah, there it is. You can rent them. Oh God. Maybe I'm wrong guys, this is the highest point. I see her now. There she is. So if you guys missed where we are, we're in Eau Diable Vert. It's a Quebec camping ground in Sutton, Quebec. I don't know how to really explain that, but it's up here in Quebec. You can do all these activities and stuff. Holy crap, I'm high. Holy sh**. Woo! It's quite the drop, guys. God damn. God, I'm getting nervous now. I don't know if this thing keeps on getting higher or like what. But like, I thought the highest point was like back there somewhere. I think I'm stuck. This thing right here wouldn't let me over. Holy sh**. Okay, I'm over. I think we're reaching the end. About a 40 minute bike ride through the trees here. I kind of chopped it up a bit to make it shorter, but damn. Okay, I think we're reaching the end now. This was a success, guys. I really recommend doing it. Hey, look at you, speed demon over here. She's taking a photo. Look at you, speed demon over here. Yeah, I've been here for like 10 minutes already. Alright. Yo, that was fun. That was, that was fun. actually like, you that got cool. so high at some points, like I damn. Alright, how was that for you? Good, are you Scared tired? I'm petrified of heights. Oh god. <laughs> it says if you're not good with heights, don't do it. Yeah, nothing stops me though, you know that. Yeah, you guys know that for sure. But that was really cool, like at one point I was like so high in the air, I thought like, like if we fell, we would have been screwed. Oh yeah. The hard parts were definitely like the metal parts though. Yeah, where you have to like push your legs and stuff? Yeah. God. But did you notice too that there are some parts that like you had to just let go of the pedals and yeah. just like room? Like break a bit, yeah. Yeah. At one point I was like going so fast, like my legs are just going. I'll have this whole campground in the description. If you guys are in Quebec or near Quebec, I recommend this place. We were just about to do a Ouija, but then we found a friend. Oh, he's so cute. These things are Scottish, what are they, cattle cows? Yeah, they're cattle. They're Scottish cattle cows. And unfortunately, they're gonna be used for beef. Um, Why did you bring that up? <laughs> it's true, I mean, I hate to say it, but. Let me love They're you. also cute, though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Dude, holy crap, bro. Damn. Yeah. Yank on my yeah. sweater, yo. You're so cute. It's like a giant dog, eh? Yeah. So cute. Oh, crap. <laughs> I think you like, you like my hand, eh? You like my hand? <laughs> oh, you're cute. There's even a nice little baby over there. Oh, you're so cute. You want more attention? You want more attention? Okay. There you go. You can't eat my hand though, okay? You can't eat my hand. <laughs> you came across these things, they're super cute. Oh, you but pretty soon we will do a wee jug, that's what we came here to do. But other than that, we ran into these cows, and they're super cute. It's a huge field of them. They must have the life here. They have no shelter, though. Yo, he's like serious about this. Like, he's kneeling down and everything. This is his ground. Ow, jeez, I just shocked myself. Just don't judge me. You're gonna get shocked, dude. I think that's why he's kneeling. Oh, yeah, he just did. Aww. Go watch the fence, man. Hey, give you. I'm to photograph you. <laughs> oh, this one's coming over now. Hey, what's hey. going on? Oh, I scared it. I think I scared it. Oh, 
Look at it run. Yo, is that your baby? Yo, those things are fast. They're like miniature dogs. Yeah. That grow bigger than dogs. Yo, that's crazy. Like, personally, I've never actually seen any of these up close. So that's really interesting, too. Like, there's a whole area here. Like, you have your cabins. Like, look. There's a cabin right there that you can rent. And, like, it onlooks this whole field of cows. Yeah. And like you could actually rent different places in here that have their different views. Like there's mountains and stuff. You get that like variety of what you want, right? Oh babe, look! <laughs> oh, they're so cute. <laughs> okay, now you brought this one here. You gotta give them all grass now, Charles. Fine. Here, just You go. almost brought this one. Yeah, this one wants some now. No, he doesn't like me yet. See, he doesn't trust me. It's trying to. That one's just eating, holy. She attracted all of these ones over here, and now all of them want grass. I'm scared this one's gonna bite me though. This one doesn't have a good look on their face. Hey guys. Okay, you're starting stuff now. Wait, a little bit for you. Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no. Babies first. No. No. You wait your turn. Ta 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 roo. Buddy. Yo, this girl got these cows like whipped now. Can you not? Big. That's all he wants, Charles. Yo, this one came in like headbutted this guy. Yeah. Right out of the way. So last but not least, guys, we're gonna go do some Ouija. This is such a nice view. Every morning, every night, you wake up to like mountains and stuff. Look at that. That's amazing. And you can actually go hiking all the way up onto these mountains here. All right, I think it's time for us to do a Ouija, but I want to show you guys what our RV looks like. And it's like this 1950s style like trailer. It's called an Airstream 50s style RV trailer, but it's super old. It's like really cool looking. I just wanted to show you what it looked like. Like check this out. It's like this old like, I mean, they redone it inside. But it's this old style trailer. We are located in the woods, like to get out. We have to follow that path, but look at this. We are in the middle of nowhere though. Our trailer, what is that? I don't know what that is. Hello? Yeah, check this out. Our trailer is in this foresty area. Like if you just look around, it's this complete forest. Like look. We have all the stuff we need, but you can rent out these like little RV things. Like there's a bed here, there's another bed there, and it's like this super old looking cabin. This is all in Quebec guys too. Like we're about to do some crazy stuff here. We've been having a blast this whole week. We are about to pack up. That's why we have everything ready to go. Like if you guys don't know where we are again, I'll leave the title down in the description. You guys should seriously visit this place. I think these trailers, there's only two in this whole park. It's like the coolest add-on. We saw it on like this website and Chelsea wanted to come here. So uh, we decided to come here. Like I saw this trailer like right away and I'm like, this is the one. And uh, you never know the history about it too. It could have been like a serial killer that owned this in the 50s, you know? What was that? It's like an animal out here running around. Hello? We're seriously in the forest, so guys. For real, what the hell is that? It's a Sunday and everyone wanted to go back to work apparently, so I think we're actually the only ones, eh? Yeah, pretty much. In this place? I think there's like a couple that's, a couple cabins down, but they're far, so. You ready to do this? Mm -hmm. I'm about to lock this. It's been a while since I've done a Ouija. Are you good doing this? Yeah, I'm fine. Point, point. <laughs> it's been a while, so hopefully it goes pretty good. Fingers crossed that you don't get possessed, scratched or anything. Yeah, scratched again. There's no special effects or anything. Uh, that legit happened. But hopefully that doesn't tonight. Is that outside? I think so. You locked the door, right? I locked the door. That was outside.
You ask a question. Um, is anyone here with us tonight? Yeah. It was a little creaking. Yo, there's something coming from outside the trailer. Are you serious right now? Yo. It's going to yes. Where are you right now? It's set E right now. Are you outside? In your room? Oh my god. Yo, like, I'm not even touching that. Oh no, same. I just went to no. Are you inside with us? I'm in. I need a pillow. Yo, it got cold in here. Yeah, it did. I'm getting goosebumps now. Burr. Oh my god, Omar. Yo, it just went to yes. It just went to yes, so it's inside. Are you nice? Start the S. I'm not moving that. Me neither. I hardly have a finger on it. Charles, I'm not moving that. S F. Is that no, on F? That gave me like goosebumps. Whoa. That was not really clear. Can you tell us your name, please? Is that Ian? That's what it sounded like. It's moving. It's on H and I. Hi. Did I just say hi? It's saying hi multiple times. Are you watching us right now? No way. Yo, this is unbelievable. I'm not touching this. Oh my God. Yo, it's like turning. How's that turning right now? It's like there's more fingers right there on the top of it. Oh, 
How many of you are there around us? Is it ten? Like my battery. Did you just hear that? That was like someone went like on the table. But no, on the outside of our trailer. That's so weird because my bat. It's giving me the warning right now of oh, my yeah. battery. I just changed that battery. That's full. That's a full battery. Are you draining my battery right now? Why are you draining my camera battery? Do you not want us to record you? Film. That just said film. Do you want to be on camera? Are you? How can we help? Alright guys, we're packing up today. It's time to go. Is that everything? But my camera, I'm not joking guys, my camera, this one died right when we were in the middle of it. And to be honest, I have my DSLR. I'll actually show you guys. So basically, so basically, my camera died that I'm using right now. I have this one as my backup, which is actually a DSLR. All my batteries were dead on that one. Couldn't film. The only one that I had left was Chels, but Chels has her own SD card, you know. Um, so we didn't really bother, but all of my cameras straight up, like, crashed. And the weirdest thing is, too, I don't know if you remember this, but when we were in here doing the Ouija, we heard, like, scratching coming from outside. And this is what we found. I'm not joking. I kid you not, this is no special effects, no nothing. There's, like, marks. Like, look at this. I don't know if you can see it, but there's, like, marks on the side. And then look at this. There's scratches. I'm not sure if you can see it, but there's like scratches right there. Cause like Charles pointed this out. When we were in the middle of a Ouija, she heard like fingers kind of like rubbing on like the table or outside. And then we find that, which is like insane. But yeah, like that's just, that's crazy. That's our find. I mean, I don't know truly what happened here or if this place is truly paranormal, but. Spirits can go anywhere. This place might not even be haunted. You ready to go? Yeah. We spent two days here, or two nights, and now it's time to go. We have to haul this thing, this giant cart, all the way down the hill. So, wish us luck. We have a, we have a long way down to the car. All right, you ready? Yep. You doing this or me? Um, I'll try, but I feel like I'm gonna fall. I think this marks the end of it. I hope you guys enjoy this video. It is filmed a little bit differently. I know you guys clicked on that haunted stuff, but I kind of wanted to show you. <laughs> Are you okay? Kind of wanted to show you guys what this park here was. So hope you guys enjoyed that. I might try and come back here soon in the near future, see what's up with it. Maybe rent another Airstream RV type thing. With all that being said, guys, we're marking it off here. Uh, be sure to drop a thumbs up. Go and check out my other stuff if you guys are into the haunted. I do a lot more. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe, turn post notifications on so you guys get notified on everything. I might have to help this girl in front of me because she's going to fall down the hill. <laughs> but she's going. Like, yeah, you can rent all these, like, tree houses. It's like tree houses all up here and stuff. Just got to, like, rent them out. But... but, yeah, we're stepping out, guys. Hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.